Well, Alyssa, were you aware that the Texas Panhandle is home to the cheeseburger capital of Texas? It's not in Amarillo. So I was aware, but apparently not a lot of people are, which I was surprised by. We need to spread awareness right? about this. Friona, Texas is the cheeseburger capital of Texas. And here's the thing is they have like a cheeseburger challenge. Mm -hmm. There's a cheeseburger passport, which I, I think I got to go check one of these out because one, it highlights local businesses, all about that. And two, it's highlighting really tasty cheeseburgers, I feel like. So I need to check this out. So Ruben went down the road to visit Friona to kind of tell us a little more about what's going on there. We are the cheeseburger capital of Texas. So that happened in 2007. We were granted that. And so every uh, third Saturday in July, we have a cheeseburger festival. So we have cook-off teams, vendors, um, they all come out. You can purchase a wristband and you get to taste all of the cheeseburgers. That's kind of the goal. So I feel like it's important because, I mean, that festival brings in a lot of people, not just for us as a business, but like, I mean, out of the 100 people, one of them might get a flat tire and stop at Gato's or stop over here and need gas. It's just, it's a whole thing for the community, a car wash. It's just a whole all around good. So we have five cheeseburger stops, um, and this was more kind of for the locals. We get to try these cheeseburgers year-round. So um, five restaurants dedicated a special cheeseburger on their menu um, to be part of the program. And so we did a little challenge. Um, we tried the cheeseburgers last year, and so now we wanted to give the opportunity to the community to do the same and kind of drive traffic into the businesses. Um, so we put a challenge together. Each business has a stamp, and you have to go and purchase um, their cheeseburger and get your passport stamped and then you get to come back and um, if you completed them all you get a wristband and a t-shirt. We're a mom and pop shop so without the community we wouldn't be here without most of these businesses are family owned that's how, what tells about Friona how they're loving and caring about their communities it's just so the support here is crazy so it's just a good community to be in. The chamber is not mine, it's not uh, Mari's, it's Friona's. This is the business's um, office, headquarters, resources, anything like that. So um, yeah, it's, it's not our funds, it's Friona's funds. So we're trying to provide resources for our businesses. Even if they have ideas, we kind of provide an outlet. If they want to put something together, if they want an activity to come, they can come speak to us and we're gonna try to put it together for them. Or also if they need help advertising or they don't know how to balance you know, a checkbook or need help on QuickBooks, that's kind of where we kind of step in and try to help them um, bridge the gap.